But guess what? We got breaking news. Hatchet Man has resigned. No, go ahead. De- real breaking sports news. Stoney, you ready for this? I see it, yes. Yeah, I'm not tired. Here you go. Adam Schefter. Now the deal is done in Detroit. The Lions are signing Jared Goff to a four-year deal, $212 million, $170 million fully guaranteed. Four at 212. That's yes. 50. Wow. Wow. Three. Wow. So he becomes the highest paid Lion in franchise history. Let's go live to Jared Goff. Oh, my God. Wow. Look, I wanted him paid, but I can't sit here and tell you that that number doesn't sound high. <sighs> well, wow. $170 million is guaranteed, so if he doesn't play well towards the end, it's bye-bye. So, so what's 170 divided by four? That would be 40. No, no, the guarantee, look, you're going to get a vast majority fully guaranteed. Right. It is more about the AAV. It's about, I told you I was very comfortable going to the mid 40s, high 40s. And I talked, I'm going, look, four at 190, is it four at 200? But they went four at 212. That is a major commitment. I mean, you're you're entering like Joe Burrow land. You know, you're paying a guy fifty three million dollars a year. Now, when QBs do their deals, this deal will now begin to slide down. Correct. But in the here and now, you're paying Jared Goff as one of the five best quarterbacks in football. Pull up the quarterback salaries. You're making a major commitment. Now, I know for people like this goofball, where is he here? Hold on. I'm sure he's crying on his catio right now, but Jerry Goff's your guy, which is every reason the Hendon Hooker pick was stupid, is stupid now, and will forever be stupid. Jerry Goff just got Burrow money. He just got Justin Herbert money. He has 53 AAV, so Joel Burrow is 55, and Justin Herbert's 52 and a half, so he's right in the middle. All right, yeah. I mean, David, I don't have a problem with Goff's reps gunning after it i don't have a problem with jared goff feeling like he deserves it the lions there was never a scenario to anybody with a brain that they were going to let this guy walk no ever i never understood the show topics about it i never understood the portion not the majority the portion of the fan base who who thought hendon hooker was a thing oh the point is he was always going to get paid, but now that he is paid, I need to hear from you guys. Four at 212 is a massive number. And the Lions, if you do the math, uh, over the last two weeks have awarded over $444 million in contract extensions to three players. And shout out to ownership for yes, this reason. Yes, exactly. Honestly, no, because what people don't realize is when you sign these deals, the guaranteed money portion of that has to go into escrow. That's not funny money. No. The owners have to have the money. Right. They're actually placing money somewhere. That's why you you have to credit Brad Holmes, but you have to credit Sheila Ford Hamper. Yes. You know, owners handing out about a half a billion dollars in deals with about 300 million of it guaranteed. Yeah, that's real money coming from real accounts. In a perfect world, I would have rather seen it be a little less, but I understand that's what the market is. And God forbid he get hurt. No, no, no. Here's here's the other side of it. I will tell you what the Goff extension means. I want to tell you what I believe it means. Because Lion fan has to wrap their mind around something that they have never approached. So let me throw the number out. 248-539-9797. I'm good. I wanted Jared Goff signed. I don't have a problem. I'm not going to sweat the details. I can be surprised it's as high as it is. I'm not upset about it. No. And good on Jared's reps for being able to get the money. What were the Lions going to do? Go into the franchise tag? Alienate their franchise QB? Get into drama? No. But I, I think this does mean something that I don't know you'll agree with or fans agree with, but what the hell? I'm not in the business of agreements. We're in the business of opinions. I want to do this next. I just got to take care of one quick business thing.